Hey guys, Jen here from Craft Penguin Planner. Welcome to my channel. Today we are planning the week of September 4th through the 10th in my Panici and we're going to use this kit from my shop. This is the They Fly kit. It's really pretty with the birds. Um, and it's a fall kit. Yes, it's September. I'm using fall. So here we go. Bring out the fall kit. Bring on the fall weather. I'm ready for it. I'm tired of the heat. And yeah. So um, we'll, we'll address the elephant in the room first. Band-Aid over my thumb. I somehow managed to cut myself like right here um, earlier today. So that's going to make this a lot of fun trying to plan um, because like you you try peeling stickers and sticking them down when you have a big old band-aid over your thumb on your dominant hand yeah it's not easy now how this happened i don't even know I, I don't even know it had to have been done in conjunction with me cleaning the paper cutter i get that much it's not a deep cut it's just like just a little more than um paper cut depth but it, i mean it, it bled pretty good um i don't know why i did that because i'm gonna be needing these extra probably today um the when i clean the paper cutter since it's on the right i to clean that blade i kind of gotta use my left hand more so this doesn't actually come in contact with the blade I use this to do the bottom, like the blade piece at the bottom, not the blade itself. The piece where the blade rubs against as it goes down. I don't know what you call that, the plate or whatever. I don't know what the technical term for that is. But, um, so I don't know how I cut it on my right hand. If it was going to be the blade, it would have been over here. I, I really, I, I don't get it. So... I don't know how it happened, but long story short, I managed to slit my the tip of my thumb a little bit, and um, luckily, we did not get any blood anywhere on anything, and I made sure I cleaned up everything over there pretty well. Like I said, there was no blood on anything, so I just, I don't know how it happened so there you go now i just have to um deal with this band-aid for you know a day or so and then i'll take it off i i took it off just to um clean it and oh my goodness yeah clean it again you know what i mean and switch out the band-aid and yeah it i i can't leave it off right now so it is what it is it's too soon but anywho i think i forgot now that i was thinking about it i was gonna say you know i'm really excited about what i released yesterday and coming into today it's been a week it's been a week you guys that's why i'm doing this one because i don't have time for an 85 wide today i'm sorry i just i don't not if i want to relax and plan um you know and watch hallmark tonight i don't um guys this is really awkward with this band-aid on but you know it would be more awkward using the tweezers i think i don't know maybe i'm wrong but i think it would be weird using the tweezers for this but um it's been a long, busy week, and everything that could get in the way of me working has gotten in the way of me working, and so I mostly got a weekly kit done and just couldn't get it up in time yesterday for releases, but I got it up today. It is now up. It is live in the shop, um, but I've been working all day to make that happen. Um because I had to finish the last little bit. It was like the smaller size kits, like the Hobonichi um, 
slash Panici, the Hobo Cousin, the Vertical Weeks, and the Daily. Those are the ones I had to do. The full kit was already done. I just, I needed um, to finish the smaller sizes to get it all completed up. Completed and up. And I find I'm more likely to get it completely up and get it finished if I don't have any of it released than if I release part of it at a time. So, it's just better to release all at once than in segments. So, I mean, I've been... Ugh, it's crooked. And I can't use this thumb to peel stuff up. <laughs> it's so weird, you guys. Um, You never how, know how much you rely on stuff like that until using it is an issue. But, um... So yeah, today I've been playing catch up on stuff from the week that I didn't get to finish because of one reason or another. Mostly, I'll blame the website, but yeah, that saga continues. But anyways, that's up and um, I realized that I think I forgot to post my short over here on YouTube. I posted the reel on Instagram and TikTok and everywhere. I think I forgot YouTube. And I'm, I, I, I felt like I was missing something yesterday when I was sharing and I just couldn't put my finger on it. Yeah, that's what it was. It was here. And I'm sorry. I apologize. But I've been doing like the Doodle Grid um, collection. Oh, yeah. Here's a glimpse at that um new kit that just came out today too cute to spook it's so cute that's the full boxes anyways um but like the doodle grid squares and circles and then i just added um the hexagons these are hand drawn these ones and the octagons are hand drawn um but this particular collection with this color palette it is now a monthly bundle. And um, the monthly bundle also includes a sheet of these brush strokes. So with the monthly bundle, that's a monthly bundle. If you don't like foil, that's perfect for you. Um, I wanted something different and unique. It's something I've been wanting to do for quite some time now. I just haven't you know, I hadn't put my finger on what I exactly I wanted to do with it. Um, in fact, doing something with the different color palettes like that each month where the color palette changes has been on my radar for longer than my foil bundle, if that says anything. I just, I wanted something different than um, what I, you know, than what shops offer. A lot of shops offer some sort of mon monthly functional bundle. But I wanted something completely different. And, you know, I released the foil bundle first because that's what I came out with first. And that has been almost a year now that that one's been available. And finally, I decided what I wanted to do. I've been loving those grid um, or shapes, the doodle grid shapes since I first started releasing them. Wanted to do more with it. Finally got, um, you know, stuff added to it. Oh, I do need that now. Um, I didn't grab out another sheet of these, but that blue actually should work just fine. So we'll use these. These are from Plan with Peggy Co. These are from Cheerful Planner Girl. I mean, it's not really the best, but I don't feel it digging through. It is blue, and there is blue in this, so it'll work. There's a little bit of darker blue in the birds, too. So, like I said, it's fine. Um, oh, I need the sneakers first. Um, so I did release that yesterday. I also released the hexagons and the octagons yesterday since, um, I guess I could use some blue. We can use orange, yellow, even some red. I think we can mix a few of those all together in here because, oh, actually, even brown. 
and the green. Heck, we might just be able to mix like all the colors together here, huh? Because they're a lot of, oh, that's like fallish. And I guess we can use black if we're going to continue to make it like all different colors. Let's do that. That looks good. All right. Um, so yeah, I finally released that. The bundles you can't use a coupon code on because they're already discounted that way. Like their price that's listed is, you know, like, I want to say it's, I put it at around 30% off already when I listed them. So that's why I don't allow coupon codes on it. You can buy them with other things because I make it where the coupon code just doesn't attach to it. So, you know, it's it's fine if you have that stuff in the cart with it, but with other things that you do use a coupon code on. But um, they're already on sale. So with the Doodle Bundle, the color palette will change every month. The sheets will remain the same. Just like with the Foil Bundle, the sheets pretty much stay the same, except with the Foil Bundle, the overlays and underlays change but the foil color changes too. With this, it'll be a color palette that changes. So, um, two, four, six, seven. Oh, okay, I won't need this other one. Yeah, beautiful. Um, like you can't talk and count mentally. That's why I had to count out loud, apparently. Um, so yeah, I'm excited for that doodle bundle. I've been wanting to do something for a long time. That's what I was keeping secret the last time. Um, and I was telling you, you'd have to wait. And then the other thing I told you you'd have to wait to find out more on was actually the fact that, um, uh, I'm having a Labor Day sale this weekend. And believe it or not, I decided to launch it early. It wasn't going to go up until tomorrow, but I decided to go ahead and launch it early. Since I was already putting stuff up on the site and doing stuff like that, um, because I was finishing up with that kit, I'm like, while I'm here, let's just activate the code and go from there. It's a code on my end. You don't need a code to check out. Um, it's an automatic code, basically. So, if you want to save on sticker items this weekend, including this kit... Um, now's a good time. Um, any time from now through Monday night at midnight, midnight, Monday night, the sale will be gone and you will have missed it. So don't miss it. If you want to save 30%, the only things that are excluded, excluded, like I said, the bundles cannot be, um, these are from playing with spoons, all these trackers and about to use, um, the, Let's use red. No, let's use the brown on this one. We'll use the red on the other one. Um, the bundles are excluded from the code. The, let's go yellow. Um, I'm gonna have to print myself some more of these apparently. Um, the code's excluded. The bundles are excluded. The, and other things that like say no coupons, like oops and overstock. Those are excluded, but it's sticker items only. So the albums, notepads, that kind of stuff is not on sale this weekend. Just the stickers, okay? But um, I hope that's not too confusing. Sticker items minus like oops, overstock, and monthly bundles customs are included all right and i do need a um habit tracker of sorts so i think i was planning on using one of these orange ones i could use a green because then it would be different from that i could use a green or i could use that one okay either way Let's use that one. Um, this one's from Lisa Lorraine Plans. Um, so, yeah. 
sale this weekend. But this week has been, like I said, this week has been kind of all over the place because I, these are from Paper Boys and Berry Pie. Um, I've been working on a lot of the back end website stuff. I still cannot get the update to take without, um, these and the other ones coming up of the Molly's are itty bitty sticker co. Um, I can't take, I can't get the update to stick without making the website like literally drag and I don't want that. The website, guys, I got the website optimized where it is running well. Let me tell you, it is running really, really well currently. But I still need to get the other update done in prep for the other update that's coming. So I'm going to have to reach out to my host. These are from Inspire Ever After. To... Um, see what else I, what else what am i missing because i've optimized everything images all the things it is running as great as it has ever run it is running beautifully from uh, beyond paper flowers this as well um the website is performing at top notch right now so that what that means for you is it's definitely going to load a lot faster it um that's the only thing you guys physically should notice on the front end of the site the back end of the site is a bit different but um just because you know so much involved for me but for you guys the only thing that you should notice is the speed of the website you should definitely notice that that has improved drastically so, um, but if you do notice any problems or anything, let me know because I need to know that. Um, and most likely I don't know that if I'm not already working on fixing it. You know what I'm saying? So why do I feel like that's crooked? Probably is a little bit. Um... But yeah, the, the website is running well. It is performing very well right now. And as soon as I flip the switch on that other update, now I just made it worse. Um, it, it drags the site down because it's maxing out the memory on the back end, which is weird. And I can't figure out why. So I have to reach out to my site host to get that fixed because I don't know what I'm doing. If there's anything I've learned over the past two weeks, it's that I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> with the back end of the website. But I have learned a whole lot. Have I been going crazy trying to deal with this? Yes. Yes, I have. I have lost my ever-loving mind. I am tired and I have truly lost it. But... I have learned a whole lot. So, thank you to Google and YouTube. Because, uh... I wouldn't know what I was doing otherwise. Alright, so now we just gotta do the top here. Um, which are my goals for the week. Which I really need to get better about actually doing stuff, you know, like working out. I've been attempting to, but, um, life, life, life. These are from Jackie, formerly Keep It Simple Stickers now. Stickers by Jackie M. Of course, these are not in her shop currently. I don't know if she plans on bringing them back in some capacity at all or not. I don't know. I mean... I wouldn't complain if she did. Just saying. But, um, mm, let's use that one. Um, you know, either way, still letting you know that's where they came from. But, uh, yeah. So, that's been kind of my week in a nutshell. I've been working to the nth degree. And, um, these are from Pretty Planner. And also things like, you know, errands and that kind of thing. And yesterday I watched a munchkin, so. 
you know, our friend's youngest um, was here with me. They, they started school this week. And for whatever reason, they decided, you know, let's give them not just Monday next week off for Labor Day. Let's give them Friday off too. And she had nobody else that could watch her. So I'm like, yeah, it's fine. I have work I need to get done, but um, I I can work on that while she's here too. And I did. I got, you know, release stuff taken care of while she was here. Um, I didn't work the whole time, but I actually did um, some orders last night after she was gone and everything because I wanted those to get out today because Monday being holiday, you know, things won't ship again until Tuesday. So I wanted to make sure anything I had uh, done, you know, had for orders was shipped today. So I managed to get that out, which was great. So it worked out. I've been tired, but I got things done that needed to get done. I still got quite a bit here. I can always pull in somewhere or, you know, put in my reusable sticker book for some other time. But, um, yeah, so that's my week. In a nutshell, it's been crazy. It's been busy. So today was a little bit of a catching up day to get things done that should have been done up yesterday. But now that this is done, I am going to get off of here, go make myself dinner while this uploads. So that way I can, you know, post this so you know it's live. And, um... Then go plan and watch Hallmark. So that's my plans for tonight. I hope you guys have a fabulous weekend. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And we'll chat soon. Bye, guys.